What's up guys, uh, today is going to be a very different video and um, I really don't, I'm not into football anymore much like I, I like um, rugby than I always do play for a hobby there but um, I do watch like YouTube and football such as like Hashtag United and that's what I'm going to come to today I feel as if Like I watched the final four and they all could have gone through and I'm gonna give you reasons why they all could have gone through. Now um first one, Scott Pollock's reason he go through and he and he did go through. It was him and Jack Dirk and I went through. And um let me just give you all their names. So it was Jack Dirk and Scott Pollock, Daniel Adji and um I can't believe I forgot his name. I've been watching him all day. Jamel. Yeah. So, um, sorry if you can hear me in the Xbox. So. so, um, why they all could have gone through? Go public 16. Still, he's still got about three or four years of development. So. Yeah, he, he, he's develop. He could develop, obviously, and um, that's the main reason in developing. I, but the only weakness he has, in terms of today's episode, is mental strength. I I feel he's a bit quiet. You know, and I'm not. Yeah, he's sixteen. But you know, we move on to Jack Dirk and he have one and two. I'd put him in through just because of his football inability. What's up, boy? He go through to the last four. Um, he just seemed normal, you know. Seb, Seb Spencer's brother who plays left wing for Hashtag. He said that, um, well, let's refer him to his YouTube channel, Dirks. His, his old videos were kind of like could class as inappropriate and obviously Spencer's channel is a clean channel he's, he don't swear on his YouTube channel but um yeah and Dirks there's of nearly 20k but um yeah, do you, you, I'm, I'm not saying this because I'm jealous at all, but um, the only reason he's on 20k is because of the hashtag United thing now. I believe before the hashtag thing came about. And before the hashtag thing came about, um, Dirks. Let's see how many subs he had. I really should prepare myself for the script before. Obviously it's unscripted. Dirks. What's this about? Dirks like. Before. Hashtag. He's on the boat. Two and a half k, two and a half k subs, and it's purely profited because of of the hashtag. I mean, like he did grow last summer. I mean, he had two k subs in a month. That's grown, but he's grown purely because of of. He's been documenting it on his channel making vlogs. We're going to Danny Largy now. Good footballer, good skills. And I like his maturity. I think he interviews he's mature and Seb did say he took a long time to answer questions for the way he structured his answer. Uh, it, it, it's 
following the spoke mature. You know, and he's a good person, you know, good luck. But mature at the same time. His maturity is good, he's a tough person. And I can see in the future why maybe could come back and get play for a team. I believe I should start the YouTube channel because you get a few subs. And he's not in the team, so he's obviously profited. He'll obviously profit off it now. Now, um, Jamal Hakeem, beast of a player, six foot three, I think he said in one of his videos. I mean, he's probably at least 200 pounds, which is about 15, 16 stone. Not even 15 stone, but in retard. Um, but, um, he's very strong in his video. I did see him bench press 120 which is basically 20 stone give or take a few pounds very strong good defender and bolsters up the back him and Sam Adams and that Sam Adams is about 6 foot 1 2 I think and that would be a good defensive partnership because Rich Beck isn't always there no Jamal. The only reason they did not pick Jamal is because he's got a YouTube channel and they thought that would be unfair to give someone as well the only chance. They thought I might be biased. But he should have gone for only his football and ability. Really. And this YouTube channel is like self made. He's, he's already on 100k before. Any of this happened, he's coming here 145k. And I'm gonna make in this video today. He has made over 25k subs. Because in the end of the video, he's had um, 12 journeys over, blah blah. And I'm thanked and he used my YouTube. So I've dropped a sub to him. Because I like him, he's a funny person, you know. And, um, yeah, but I th think they all should have went for Jamel and, um, Jack Burks, and I have football abilities, um, Scott Paulus, who used development, Daniel Hodge, maturity, he's actually very good sk at skills, he, I did see a video of him, to a couple of skills, like in a classical special, but, the two I thought I should have went through, Scott Pollock and um, Daniel Algy, the Dirks have got a YouTube channel, but, but, um, but, um, you know, Dirks is a YouTuber, why didn't he go out with him, like one's YouTuber, one, you know, sorry to, um, Cut off a bit then, you hear my dog crying, blah blah. So, um, I think they all should have went through. And, um, yeah. Well, no one should have went through, but they all had reasons to go through. I think Dirks, if um, Jamal went out because his YouTube, Dirks should have gone out because his YouTube. So um, that's the end of the video guys, try your opinions with me if you watched as well, and um, catch you in the next episode, peace.